What is up, YouTube? Frost the Hobbit in here, and today we're back with another Sonic IDW issue 60. In this issue, we're continuing the battle as our heroes have been separated, Shadow and Omega's gone missing, and Tangle is in trouble due to Egg Eggman hunting, him, hunting, hunting her down with, with, the, with his new device trap. The following cast is Sonic the Hedgehog, Tangle the Lemur, Whisper the Wolf, Linolan. The Nolan, the Sheep, Amy Rose, Amy Miles Tails Prower, Silver the Hedgehog, Blaze the Cat, Shadow the Hedgehog, Rouge the Bat, E123 Omega, and Dr. Eggman. Let's get on to this comic book, shall we? We last left off, Bla Tangle the Lemur was going was phasing through the tower of the building. Saying, as she's trying to grab onto something, she just has to concentrate. As she phases through the ground, she pops back up, only to be meet with an, a de very determined, power-hungry Metal Sonic. Who went, well, not power-hungry, basically just hunting very, uh, hunt a very determined Metal Sonic who wants to hunt her down, using those things to capture her. She dodges, she dodges, she tries to tell herself not to panic. Metal Sonic is not giving her any chance to breathe, and when Metal Sonic goes to the corner to see where she went to, she disappears. Metal Sonic takes a moment of this and leaves. Which allows Tangle to believe it's safe. Tangle's believing that he's gone, and that what, and what did want to know what those traps would do to her, and what did they do to her friends? He says she gotta tell Sonic and the others of what's going on. But Nolan and the and Whisper are in are in trouble, and she promised that she would save those two. So she has to snap out of her own funk and get moving forward. Unaware that um, Metal Sonic was waiting for waiting for her to come out. So, she, so, which big, big brain thinking on Metal Sonic lead him to where the others are located. They meet off where Sonic, Tails, Amy, Silver, Blaze, and Rouge are. As they point out that it's simple that as they reach the Eggman's base, they will be able to shut down everything and head to the towers. Silver is very determined on, determined to take down Eggman as he's believe they got this. But Blaze tells him to not to rush things. He can't be can't assume victory before it re before it even begun, and Tails has to agree. The odds of success is very important here. And Rude shines in and says that she she wants wants to give it at their best, especially rescuing Shadow and Omega. Amy Silver said that does make sense, and Amy Rose tells him it's always best to have a calm and cool head. And when Tango until uh, Tango pops out of nowhere and says, "Finally, guys." Which spooks Amy Rose completely, and she accidentally crushes the Miles Electric. Rest in peace, Miles Electric. That thing's been around since Sonic Unleash. Which Tails is very sad about it. Amy Rose apologized, but Sonic is very okay. That just happened. So uh, what now? And Silver wants to know, Tango, how did you? Silver wants to know, uh, what? What's with the uh, new? Is this a new power you have? Tails is amazed by it as Tango is telling, as well as Blaze is amazed by it. Tango is telling them that, that, that everything is important, that the Diamond Cutters are in trouble, everyone needs to help out. Sonic said, calm down, what what trap? Did, the tra did that trap that we met did this to you? Tango said, in a way, kind of. Eggman said it was meant for something and they got Tank Whisper and Lil Nolan. And Sonic notices the trap above him that was trying to get him and he immediately dodges in the last second, which means Metal Sonic is here. As Metal Sonic sent the traps to go after other characters, he would go after Sonic himself. Tangle is worried that he used, she's saying that, she, that Metal Sonic used him, used her to lead to the others. And she warns him not to let those catch you, Blaze the cat stepped in and make sure that Silver doesn't get caught. Sonic says that green light. I think it's the same trap as the other that caught the diamond cutters. Silver makes sure that that won't happen again as he dis disrupts them. As Metal Sonic is ready to fight Sonic while Silver's there, Amy Rose is like, "I ain't having any time of this. We ain't wasting no time." As she breaks the debris, causing Metal Sonic to fall, it, which Rouge approves of. As Tails saying that we should get mo moving before he comes back, and Tangle agrees, we have to figure out how to take down the city, but first we need Shadow the Hedgehog's help. As Shadow's chaos control 
kind of overloaded the systems. So Blaze, Silver, and Rouge would go out, go out to find Shadow the Hedgehog. And luckily, luckily they managed to meet E123 Omega, who was still intact, thank goodness. Rouge, Rouge is a day, you are you still in one piece? Omega said, affirmative, as soon as I am free, I will extract my vengeance on those terrain, on those treacherous terrains, <laughs> which M Omega as Kiddo Omega. Marouge has to be careful because it's drawing energy as they all, all of them are falling to the ground. They see Shadow the Hedgehog trapped by cri Chaos Crystals. And Rouge is trying to get there to, to set him free, only to meet there are still sh Shadow Androids lurking around. Meanwhile, we meet back with Sonic, Tails, Amy, and Tangle as they are going down the elevator and trying to find a way to get to Eggman's control tower. They have to find a way to control, get to control rooms and disable Eggman's safeguards, which Tangle told them about that those safeguards is the key to cause the city to overload. And and, and find a way to rescue Tank Whisper and Lanol and and that and Lanolin, 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 Lanolin. I don't I don't care how I pronounce that. As, and stop the city from growing fast. Tails said, "Yes, that would keep the city and put a stop the city from expanding. Things would have been easier if he had his Mas Electric, which Amy Rose did apologize for again. And they want to know why they stopped, only to see Metal Sonic cutting the cables, trying to help them fall to their dooms. Which Tails grabs Sonic, and Tails grabs Sonic and Amy and Tangle and the others, but Metal Sonic starts to tackle Sonic." Because he wants to wants to take down the blue hedgehog once and for all. Tangle's not having it as she uses her tails to blind him and use him as using as a, a way to fly up. As Sonic homing attacks up, leading their way to the top. We meet back with Omega, Rouge, Blaze, and Silver as the Shadow Androids are in their way. They require an opening. Omega gives them that opening as he opens fires on those shadow androids. Blaze tries to use the try to use the screwdriver kit to get to break through those crystals, only for her to get zapped by the chaos crystals because they are overloading with power. Blaze tells him, "Do not get too close." Silver says he can handle it, and when he does try to touch it, it zaps him, as it is way too much chaos power as Shadow is still stuck in there. This is going to be very difficult. As Silver tries to use the psychokinesis to move the crystals, it keeps growing more crystals. Silver said this is bad, but if going faster, the more I tear it apart. Blaze calls out Blaze calls out his name, Silver, and they both nod in agreement as she's telling him he got this. Which Silver takes as encouragement as he does the best he can to free Shadow the Hedgehog. Meanwhile, with Dr. Eggman at the egg base, he said, and that's it, Shadow. Use your chaos control. Made made the fake emeralds unstable. Keep it up, you fool. The more you try to use my emeralds, the, the bigger it gets. More power for me and for my city. Orobot tells him, Isn't it quite dangerous for him to keep doing this, sir? Eggman says, Not a problem. As long as my safeguards are 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 in use, are, are, that's what my safeguards are for. If the power overloads, I can just reboot the system again, and everything will be back to normal. Until Sonic and his friends showed up, he said, "Sorry, Eggy, I, we sorry we didn't knock before." Eggman said, "What did you do to metal?" He said, "Someone's getting a very strict patch after this." Which Amy Rose knocks Eggman out of his control panel, leaving Tails to take control. As the rope, as the little control. As little green trap bots are set free to go after any Tangle, Metals would go after Sonic the Hedgehog himself. And Sonic is easily taken down, is easily taking on Metal. Like, he's not taking him as a challenge. Amy Rose is keeping a Eggman at bay, and Eggman decides, useless. If you want something done right, I gotta do ev you gotta do it yourself. As he brings out the gun again, shooting Amy Rose's hammer out of her hands, which distracted Sonic, causing Metal Sonic to sucker punch him in the face. As Sonic and Amy are down, Tangle's about to get trapped. Tails is the only one there left as he is doing everything he can to shut down the safeguards, using his tails to smack Eggman in the face and say, hey, would you stop doing that? <laughs> Which is very hilarious. As Tangle's about to get trapped, Egg Tails did the final button and shut down the safeguards. Which Eggman is not happy. 
Because, as Shadow's Chaos powers are affecting it, Eggman said, you fool, you have no idea. Without the, the safeguard limiters, there's no stopping the city, the Emerald's growth, as the Emerald Crystals are increasingly growing all over the city in an unstable way. Eggman is not happy about this, so he said, fine. Time for Plan B. And Plan B is that his control tower just pops out of the city and starts to walk out. And that's where we issue ends with Plan B, apparently. Next time is the, I believe it's the final issue of this Eggman City attack. And hopefully Sonic and the others get to free Nanolin and Whisper and Shadow as well. Overall, this, this was Sonic IDW issue 60. I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. What were your thoughts on this issue? Did you enjoy it? What were your favorite parts on this? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, who is your favorite Sonic the Hedgehog character? As always, take care, have a great day, be safe, and most importantly, stay frosty and stay healthy out there. Catch you all later and make sure to wash your hands. Take care, everyone. Aloha! You guys reached the end of the video. I want to say a special shout out to the following Patreons listed on, listed on this list. Oceano Brana, Cameron Carpenter, David Destiny, Marcus Angel Boy 101, Judah J Jujus, Jay the Real McCoy, Dakota Umluff, Zach Cow, Boss Maker, Nevin Punzel, Curtis Wildcat, and Matthew Hensley. I'm sorry if I butchered those names. I just want to say thank you guys for being a member of the being a member of my Patreon, for being a member of the Hobbiton Scout, Hobbiton's race. <laughs> And if you guys want to join, you know the rules. Link in the description down below. Take care. Have a great day. Be safe. Alfred, you need to get down there and activate the Sub-Zero Core. Yeah, you'd like that, wouldn't you? I'm not saying that you jump. Good, because I'm not going to. Uh, just climb on my back. Fine, I'm out anyway. Hell's about to freeze over, and I haven't even conquered the world yet. <laughs>